Hey everybody, AmpReparaGuy.com here. So, here we have another LK500. So, first things first, the knob wasn't oriented properly. It was like close to in between each band selection. This has 10 meters in it. So, he told me that uh, someone was using his amplifier and they had the band switch on the wrong band. I, I don't know what happened. So anyway, had some issues. So I went ahead and pulled the tubes and high potted them. They ended up having a grid to filament short in each tube. Took a video, supplied it to the customer. I'm gonna give him his old tubes back if he wants them. So bought new I had them buy new Penta Laboratory tubes, awesome tubes, great, not a single problem yet. Awesome people there, great customer service. So, check the error variable, looks good. I ended up putting a series glitch resistor in over there. I put that standoff in, as you can see. So. The contact here on the band switch wasn't making a really good connection, so sometimes it was arcing a little bit. So I pulled it back a little bit. No pitting or anything. Still had, uh, after I cleaned it with deoxy gold, no sandpaper, none of that crap, no files, because you'll take the contact coating right off. Um, put deoxy gold on it. Uh, and then, well, actually, first I ended up loosening this nut and the nut down there. And I was able to move this out after I removed this wire. So I was able to bend the armature with the contact outwards and twist it so it's perfectly lined up. And I put some deoxy gold on it, moved it back and forth a million times, put a little pressure on it, pried it back a little bit, nice and shiny to look at it. It's nice and smooth, has that dome shape on the contact, so it's still good. So there's a little bit of carbon between the contact. I ended up using rubbing alcohol and a Q-tip. So that's good. Clean the other rotary switch over here. Checked everything else out. Now she's good to go. Produces full output on all bands. And that's that. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I have Numerich on 811H here also. They finally shipped the part. It was out of stock. It, everybody's, you know, the supply chain's messed up on everything. The SB200 over there on the other side of the bench. I have some more amplifiers coming. So keep them coming. I love working on these amps. And, uh,. I want to point out, Penta Labs always sends the tubes out right away to me. And the reason why I have the customer purchase them is so the warranty carries through the customer, not me. Gosh, but they ever had an issue. So, thanks for watching. Have a great day. AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119.